Within the hair community, there exists a misconception of what locks are. Though they are seen as nappy or maybe messy to others, the reality of locks is an intricate story that is shared by many and a journey within itself. It is old, new, alive and dead hair all matted together, um, kind of like a gumbo, if you will. Um, and once it's all put together, you can style it, you could cut it, you could just let it grow, you could do all kinds of things. It's, it's very versatile. And so this is a great example, like one of mine. You can do things with it, shorten it up, but you see the length of it, how long it really is. And this is only a seven to eight year mark. Here on Two Notch Road, Cream de la Creme, or the best of the best, has locticians that specializes in locking, hair extensions, and a variety of other things. The name of our business is Creme de la Creme, which is French for the best of the best. Because not only our stylists are the best, our clients are the best, our styles are the best, services are the best, best prices, best atmosphere, best everything. Amidst the COVID pandemic, Creme de la Creme has established safety measures to ensure the standard of being the best of the best is continued. Uh, with COVID, you know, it kind of put a halt on a couple of things. I mean, it was like a reality check because no one ever expected anything like that to happen. Due to the, the pandemic that we're now experiencing, we, hit, we cannot hang out and congregate like we used to. We have to be mindful of, um, of distance. We have to be mindful of sanitary uh, measures and stuff like that. As time progresses, so does the future of Cream de la Creme and the acceptance of locks within the professional setting. Definitely after COVID is over, we are planning on expanding, but we want to still take our precautions. We're starting to embrace our curl, if you will, and we're embracing our heritage. And that's one thing that I'm glad that we're doing now because it's not, a, we're, we're being ourselves, we're being liberated through our locks. Owning your hair, doing what you want with your hair, no one's telling you, you gotta do this, you gotta do that. You know, you're free with them. And, and most of our people who have them, believe me, those are some of the most free people because they really do not care about what you or anyone think about their hair. Once they lock their hair up, they're letting you know that I'm in that number, I'm free. Hair is a form of expression. And for those who are locked in, there's an understanding of commitment, patience, and freedom. The lock community tells a story of growth and represents a journey of becoming the best of the best. Reporting for RNE TV, I'm Ebony Christie.